Alright, let's try to put some gasoline first. Is he gonna do it or not? You gotta put it down. I'm gonna get some two pounds of strawberry already. Let me show you how we go now. Cancel it, Jimmy. Alright, guys. Right, let's inside there right now. It's pretty similar to the Ford Gap upside down. Yeah, high for the temperature. Right up smoke, Timmy. So we can do pretty nice. Okay, I'll drop the camera. I got a flare up. That means that I didn't make it airtight.
as you can see there is fire in there but there's not quite enough air to be able to and it just went out as soon as I try and show it so you're gonna be engulfed in fire for a second well not fire um, smoke maybe I can melt a few holes through the side of this and get some more air into it That's what it should look like. When I blow on it, it gets just the right mix, but otherwise it doesn't quite get there. I got fire coming out of it, which is a good thing, which proves that what I'm doing actually does work, despite my, despite how it doesn't work exactly as I wish it would, it does work. And taking you away from that for a second, I do have some condensating gas up at the top of here, which is a nice thing to see. I put the camera back where it was before somewhat and everything seems to be working it's wow that's actually filling up with stuff look at that I have no idea what that is And these are the size of wood chunks that I'm using in the project, just scrap stuff, and then I'm going to convert over to some shredded, shredded garbage pretty much later. Thank you. 
it off. All right, and for the next thing I'm going to put in there, I'm going to put in this bucket of chips that I just got from over in the pile. See how that works out. Yeah. Here, um, pull that off. Pull the top off. Is it going to be hot? It's pulsating. Oh, that's not a good thing. Maybe. I don't know. Supposed to be somebody there in about ten minutes that he could. Uh, All right. He could kind of mosey his way over here. So. I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna move the tractor.